uh, slow down these. And this one can go over here and slow the other one next turn. Hit it. There we go. Wait. Um. See if I can make this guy go over here. Probably. You. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, start weakening this guy. No. I don't even care about the sprites. <laughs> okay. So in that case, I would say... Stop at least one of those. There we go, yeah. Yeah, good. Again. Can you reach? Um, you have five shots left. This guy is gonna hit my harpies. Is he gonna kill that many? I mean, he's he's uh, he has that bloodlust though. Yeah, that increases his hit um, his melee damage by twenty five percent, but this reduces it by uh, twenty five percent. And I also have curse on him. Yeah, I think I should be more. Oh, we didn't even reach. Okay, cool then. Golda, Hift, there we go. Nice. There we go. Keep them back there, nice. Do it again. Just keep them over here. Keep hitting these. And Cyclops keeps shooting. Yeah. If nothing else, these sprites at least <laughs> help for distraction. Yeah. Uh, come on. I can hit both. Okay, well, wait then. There we go. Now you can hit both. Now you can just melee. Yeah. And no more shots. So, gold off, kill. Here we go. <laughs> Alright, nice. So, I lost just one harpy, which is okay, I guess. Uh, well, definitely okay, versus 90 ogres. <laughs> and we got one level, level 6. Yes, I'm going to keep leveling up combat, just max combat. That's my number one priority right now. Necromancy is going to have to come later. Uh, yes. For combat and master combat. There we go. So almost grandmaster. Cool. Once you have that, I'm just gonna keep uh, for this whole scenario. I'm just gonna keep leveling up uh, combat. I think. Yeah, five five more levels. So eight's gonna be grandmaster, and then some melee hopefully. And um, hmm. And some magic resistance if I can, yeah. We'll see. And get this plus two speed bonus. There we go. And uh yeah. Alright, so now we need to start killing those and those uh and those over here. And for that, I think I'm gonna have to take my my berserkers and cycle uh, and centaurs because ghosts are not gonna help a lot in that in that case versus those guys, as I said. All right, yeah, just take those guys. 
Berserkers and uh, the Ghosts. Yes, I'm gonna take them. I'm gonna use them. You can just go to the other place. Um, and then eventually we need to go underground because underground, uh, as you can see, we have <laughs> we have a vampire dwelling with uh, some vampires for us to recruit. We have Tim vampires there. But yeah, vampires are unfortunately really nasty, as you know. You need a lot of Cyclops and a lot of other stuff to deal with those. They're very fast and uh, maybe they're going to kill one or two Cyclops. It's unfortunately something I can't really stop. Alright. Uh, whoops. Nope. Those like that. Those like this. There we go. Right, and uh, there we go. Now we're gonna go for this. Um, we can hire more lords. I don't really need more lords though. Okay, um, these guys there, these guys there. Uh, leave the ghosts out of this one because I don't want to lose them unnecessarily. And uh, yeah, oops. Like this. And let's just do it. I'm just gonna start cursing them in this one. Shoot these, sure. One of these managed to go over here and attack my my guys, but it's okay. Ah, uh, shoots! Come on, Can you do it without hitting the berserkers. There we go. Hold off. Hits. And dead. Potion of magic resistance, why not? Take it. Uh, yeah. Alright, nice. And next, this one. And goes just uh, go with me. I can get some nomads to fight the nomads. <laughs> but nah, I don't, I don't really need it, I think. Okay. And now you go here. Get a level. And yeah, all right. So next battle, this one. Just curse them. Shoot and shoot. Yeah, those guys are very fast. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Shoot this, kill this. Ouch. And there we go. So yeah, some more losses. Grandmaster combat, archery, no. And there we go. Not for now. I prefer melee. I should have taken melee before that, actually. I should have taken before uh, melee earlier. But it's going to offer it me again eventually. So yeah. Grandmaster combat. There we go. 77 defense already with Goldath. Good. Very good. Yeah. Like that. 
Yes. States. Nice. Mm, yeah, you just follow. Shall we attack right now? I usually march my undead army at night because they had an advantage over most creatures when it was dark. Despite our mastery over the night, we were still caught and aware and aware as a band of bandits rode down on a, rode down on us uh, with touches in their hands. Torches in their hands, sorry. I immediately shouted to their leader, offering him a bribe. Thankfully, you can always count on the greed on the greed of a thief. Alone, I met the man in the open field between our two armies. You say you got gold? The, ro the rogue leader asked. Yes, I'll give you every man 100 gold to walk away. The man leaked close enough that I could smell the onion on his breath and said, What if I what if I do the world a favor and kill you all? Then I can take the gold for myself. I would be hard to enjoy it. It would be hard to enjoy it because if you give the order, I'm going to break your neck. <laughs> Uh, the rogue laughed. Uh, obviously, my thin my thin frame didn't impress him much, uh, but there was something about my undead hound that the rogue didn't know. I reached up to my dead or my, my dead right arm and grabbed his wrist. Uh, with a simple twist, I broke the thug's arm. After that, I only had a few seconds before uh, his companion attacked, so I dragged the leader from his horse and closed my right hand around his neck. My undead flesh is far stronger than it appears, I whispered as I crushed the bandit's leader, leader's neck and dropped his army, uh, his limp, dropped his, uh, dropped his limp body uh, to the ground. Then the bandits, the battle began. Okay, yeah. And it's just a couple of bandits there, as you can see. Bam. And now the serious one. <laughs> this is gonna hurt for my berserkers. Yeah, they're basically dead. You can hit my hero, it's not a problem at this point. Kill these. And there we go. Okay. So the Berserkers, uh... The Berserkers were useful, they fulfilled their purpose. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Cool. They did exactly what I expected them to do. Die before the Nomads. So that, uh, so that I can just kill them with my Cyclops and stuff. Yes, go here and flag the mine. And there we go. So now, pretty much everything is mine. Uh... Now I can go kill the uh, behemoths. That's probably I should, what I should do. I think. Yeah. And let's go kill the behemoths and get that uh, gold mine, shall we? With ghosts, it's going to be very easy. And Cyclops shooting them to death. <laughs> okay. So next thing we need to build is castle. Castle and uh, cliff nest. But yeah. More berserkers in my way. Um, let's kill these first, sure. Four lords. Castle. There we go. Yeah. Come on. That's a very nice positioning right there, bro. Well, oh, we only hit two. Well, but with straight arrow. Well, now I guess I'm gonna hit maybe three. 
three now. Let's not waste the ghost for this. Golduff, attack. There we go. And magic resistance, nice. Okay. That helps. Yep. Nice. And now the behemoths. Okay, so. I'm just gonna. I think I'm gonna leave these guys as well. I'm gonna take four ghosts for the four stacks of behemoths that we're gonna have. And I'm just gonna kill them with uh, harpies and these guys. It's gonna be pretty easy, so. Yeah, I don't even need to save. Nah, it is easy. Summon some of these for distraction just in case. There we go. Take the bites. No, not sprites. I hit three. No. Exactly what I wanted you to do. Okay, so the one that didn't get H is this one, right? Yeah. So we'll go and age him. Nice. Everybody's aged now. Bam. Put the sprite over there. Come on, follow the sprite. Bam. Just stay there. Kill this, please. Ah, damn it. Was left alive with only like 15 HP or something like that. It was still enough to kill for my harpies, but eh, whatever. Okay, come on. Come over here. Cold Earth can, no, can't kill it. Harpies can kill it, there we go. Ten behemoths, and that's that. Yes, and we fight the gold mine. Uh, Dagger of Despair. This is not a bad thing to have. Although, it's not really going to help a whole lot against stuff that we're fighting. I'm not really hitting physically right now with Goldust. Not using him as a melee character. No. Okay, so give this to uh, Hero. And go back. Okay. So now everything is taken. Everything on this part of the map is taken. Now we just need to go on the ground. And um, go on the ground and take the... Those guys. The vampires. Okay. So of course, easier said than done. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna take the skeletons for that one. Yeah, those are perfect. I'm gonna take the berserkers. Yeah. I also need to build a castle in here. Yeah. Now we're getting a lot of money. Recruit everything, please. There we go. These guys. 79 of those. Uh, what? Really? Uh, sure. 
There we go. Although ghosts are not really going to be needed for this fight, but... There we go. Alright, and uh... Yeah, just give me everything. Give me skeletons, give me those. Yeah. Do I have the square formation on? Yes. These should just... I'm gonna fight them. I don't wanna, I don't wanna lose anything. Oh well, berserkers maybe. Oh, I shouldn't have taken the berserkers for this one. Oh well. Not too big a problem. Yeah, I shouldn't have taken them for this one. Eh, whatever. It's okay. Clear the path for me. Potion. None of these potions are actually gonna... Oh, holy water, maybe. <laughs> it's gonna help a little bit. Plus 20 hit points. There we go. And there we are. And we have 13 vampires here at the group, but we need to kill a band of vampires first. Okay, so... Uh, I'm gonna take everything for this fight, basically. Because we need meat shields, we need... Uh, yeah, we need... Power. Muscle. It's the only way for us to kill these guys right now, and unfortunately, um, I'm probably going to lose some Cyclops, maybe one or two, but it's how it is, so, yeah. Vampires are tough, that's the thing. Ghosts at least can stay over here. Just hold, hold ground. Hold your positions, don't move. There we go. Because those are faster than me. Stack of five. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, they're gonna... Yeah, okay, that's fine. If you do that, I'm okay. Okay, this guy has no retaliation now. Kill two? No, of course not. Just attack. All right. Nice. Can you shoot without hitting? Uh... Okay, well, I'll just hit this guy then. Yes. And this should be it. There we go. Bam. Alright. So we didn't lose cycle. We just lost some uh, heart pieces. Some nomads. Um, nomads. How do you call these? Uh, centaurs. Centaurs and berserkers. That's perfectly fine. May uh, basic melee? Yes. Thank you. Cool. Cool. Yeah. That's very, very good. Right there. And now, finally, we can get access to some uh, death spells, man. Holy crap. Okay, uh, skeletons, you can return now to town. Don't need you guys anymore. Poison. Yeah. Uh, take the money. What do we need for Thunderburst, by the way? We need... Uh, okay, so we need a lot of mercury. Which we don't have. I have to buy it. 16. Oh, whoops. Yeah, something like this. 
There we go. Although now I'm gonna spend more. Yeah, I'm gonna spend my money for the uh, vampires though, which I guess is worth it. Definitely. Holy crap, vampires. Yeah, nice. And now a bunch of skeletons. No, I could lose a vampire here. I don't trust the AI. I just do not trust the AI. Because vampires, you know, they cannot regenerate from these guys. Uh, yeah, let's not, let's not risk it. Okay, so these guys, yeah, they have 100% uh, resistance versus ranged attacks, but against the Cyclops too? That makes no sense. They're shooting you with freaking rocks, dude. Yeah, 31 cannot kill a vampire. There we go. Have one more cemetery. Do I go with those guys? They're health flag stuff. I guess. There we go. Here we have a bunch of uh, venom spawns. Venom spawns are kind of annoying, as you know. Um, but yeah, we'll try to deal with them efficiently enough. Okay. One the fireball, not really useful. Potion of strength. All right. So. Some poison are the only spells that I have. This is uh, what is this? Ray skeleton. Not really. Could have taken the skeletons for this fight. Well, plate mail. All right. So how do we do this? Uh, this is gonna be annoying. From my experience, you normally do you lose guys versus this. So unless I sacrifice the ghost or these guys. Yeah, centaurs I don't really care about. Centaurs can die. I'm worried about my vampires mainly. Mainly my vampires. And yeah. Hmm. How should we do this? Shall we go take the other spells that we have here first? Um, I wouldn't be doing this because I'm going to get enough experience to level up anyway. Uh, level 12. So I don't really need to do this, but I just want to get that one death magic spell. Which I guess isn't that important, right? I mean, it's freaking dozens. I mean, maybe something like 10 per stack. It's going to be three stacks. And those guys hit pretty hard. Yeah. Save the game. Do you have any useful potion for this one? Of course, I could put gold out here and maybe force them to shoot him. Because if he dies, it's not a big deal. Yes, well... Hmm. Don't have that many potions of immortality, actually. Okay. This. 
I can't move these guys because they're gonna shoot my Cyclops. I can, I can live with that. I can live with Lucy, some of those guys. I much prefer losing those than, than uh, the other ones. Than uh, vampires. All right, curse these as well. These, there we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, two. Those two, there we go. Hit those now. You guys can now run away, although, yeah, just run away. Now you can't kill a vampire. Even if you do, he's going to regenerate. All right. So, yeah, we did it. Lost a lot of harpies, but um, I think it was worth it. Well, not, not worth it because we're not going to get anything great, but I mean, it was definitely... Uh, it's definitely acceptable against these guys because these guys are these guys are a hell to fight. Ah, that's curse. Well, yeah, <laughs> so much for that. So it was useless, basically. Oh well. <laughs> oh well, we did it right. That's what matters. Even if it's worth for nothing. <laughs> We still did it. Vampires can just kill. There we go. Get some more ghosts. Advanced magic resistance. There we go. And I have one more level. Ah, oh, it's offering me necromancy right now. Huh? Mm. Should I start leveling up necromancy now? Or should I start doing that in the next scenario? No, I think I should start doing that in the next scenario. I think, um, I think it's important to level up this first. Uh, I mean, eventually I'm gonna have to do it. Yes, but advanced magic resistance is pretty good. We're not really fighting against a lot of magic in this campaign. On the other hand. But, um, hmm. yeah. Hmm, it's a tough decision. It's a tough decision now. Uh -huh. Will I get enough levels in the next scenario? At least, let's see, third scenario. Uh, what was the third scenario again? Am I going to need that? Uh, is it going to be crucial for that one? No, I don't think it's going to be crucial. Not for the third one. No, not for the third one. I can get it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I can still get it. I need Grandmaster for the fourth scenario. For the fourth scenario, I do need Grandmaster uh, Necromancy because it's going to help a lot in that case. Make things a whole lot easier. Disrupting ray, yeah, that's the other spell I need. And this, I'm also gonna get this. The um, the graveyard. Because we do need some money. These guys are so easy. Mm. 
I should not defend with those, but all right. Those are undead, so yeah. Careful. Oh yeah, there we go. Ah, uh, please. Some gold and co coke of warding. Okay. Not bad. Do we have one more vampire? Yes. Go recruit it. Uh, oh no, I didn't I didn't get the spell. What's wrong with me? Okay, you can get out now. Go give me some more uh, some more of those. Cliff nest. Start generating thunderbirds. Disrupting ray. Okay, now we can go. Yeah. Stay there. And I need 16 more mercury if I want to build that in the other town. I don't think I need to build it in the other town, actually. I can only have it in one town, and that's enough. Yeah. Breeding pens. Um, what I am gonna do though is I'm gonna build caravan. There we go. There's one more vampire in there. I have to do it. I just can't. Uh, I was gonna waste some movement there, but um, but you know. Alright, so recruit everything in here. Well, not the Berserkers. Or maybe even the Berserkers. Nah, yeah, I don't need the Berserkers. And I'm gonna get, let's see, 5 potions of immortality? Yeah, that's enough. No, I don't need to. I don't need to caravan them now, actually. Later. I should have recruited those. Well, yeah, we do have enough though. We have enough now. Uh, have enough to go for the for these guys. Scores of Cyclops. It is gonna be painful. Important that the hero doesn't die. Wand of healing. Uh, fireball, actually. I yeah, use fireball. Uh huh. Get some ghosts. Ooh. And Cyclops and Thunderbirds. I need Mercury. All of them. Five hundred birds, okay. Some harpies. All right. So, mm, I can do this ivory tower first. See if we can get some more spells. Um, hopefully, some level two permanent death spells, and maybe some uh, some uh, spells that are not permanent but are nice from whatever magic school. Hmm. Yeah. So do I want to fight them like this? Not gonna take these, not gonna take these. 
I'm only gonna take... Yeah, because I could lose the vampires. They could poison... No, they cannot poison them, but they can magic fist them. Um... Nah, we don't need to use them. We don't need to. Wait, do I have the yeah, right formation on? Gold of Swine, because we have a lot of um, a lot of uh, those. Oh, I should have used the healing thing in this case, in, in this battle, in case they they hurt my Cyclops, huh? Yeah, I should have done the healing thing. Damn it. Um... Yeah, I shouldn't have, shouldn't have lost those. That was my fault. Uh, this battle was not really... It was not so bright here in this one, sorry. I wasn't thinking about that. Uh, yeah, I was kind of dumb in this one. I lost five Cyclops. Oh my god, well. Scroll of Summon Air Element, or Scroll of Crowd Confusion. Oh, Crowd Confusion. Heh. Okay, that's going to be a good one for this for this fight. Chain Lightning, I can't learn that. Uh, Fire Ring, Heal, Sparks. I should have used the one of Healing, man. I could have, could have avoided losing those Cyclops. Could have healed the Poison. Yeah, that was so dumb on my side. Sorry. Okay, but I got Cloud of Confusion, though. Uh, I got Cloud of, Confu uh, Cloud of Confusion, which is going to be really useful for this one fight. Hey, hey. All right, so how do we do this? I don't think I need those. I think I just need my uh, my ghosts. And that's it. My ghosts, my uh, vampires... Thunderbirds and Cyclops, yeah. I am going to split my guys, though, because I am going to get hit once. That's just unavoidable. I am going hit, to get hit once. And, uh, and I want to lose as least troops as possible. Yeah. So maybe like this. Yeah, I think that's a good arrangement. And I can just Cloud of Confusion them. Uh, two stacks. I can Cloud of Confusion two stacks. And the Vampires and Thunderbirds can just attack them. So, yeah. Pretty good, huh? Okay. Yeah. Uh, I remember, yeah, sometimes you can get really nice spots on these Ivory Towers. Uh, once I got Mass Precision from this one, I precision my Cyclops. And it, was, <laughs> it was a very easy battle in that case. I remember. All right. So do we have more stuff? We do have one more Cyclops. I'll take it later, though. Uh, let me let me build a caravan. Yeah. All right. So yeah, this is not gonna be so hard. Now. I can just do this. Pam. Uh. All right. Keep doing this. <laughs> All right, yeah. Age these guys. Age them. I don't care if I lose one or two birds. That's okay. To have too many of those, however.
Nice. Okay, so, <laughs> yeah. Thanks to that one scroll that I got there, this battle, thankfully, was much easier than uh, it was supposed to be. But, yeah. If the game gives it to you, why not use it? Okay, so advanced melee or advanced occultism? Uh, advanced melee is really tempting. It is really tempting and it's going to help um, a lot in the next scenario. But I do need to get advanced occultism eventually because I do need to get um, demonology and then level up expert death magic. Hmm. Advanced melee is really tempting though. See, I'll get occultism this time. Okay, so there we go. Um, now we are max level for this scenario, and we can just uh, we can just go to the next one. <laughs> just finish this map and go. All right, so now let's uh, go back to our regular formation here. And there we go. So I think this is a gate that says only gold of can pass. Well, no, pretty much everybody can go through here because the green player sometimes attacks you as well. And here he is, and as you can see, he doesn't have anything. He does have a main army, one main army somewhere out there. I don't know where though. Uh, these guys, these guys can stay here for now. I'll take them later. With the caravans and yeah, go flag his stuff. There he is. There's the main green dude. Wow, he has 17 tigers that he didn't recruit. Get the gold. All right, and yeah, so. He has dozens of those, scores and company. He does have somewhat of an army, some kind of an army, but nah, nothing, nothing compared to my stuff. Bam. I should have attacked with those, oh well. And vampire skill. There we go. Uh, that's better than what I have, but eh, we'll keep that for now. All right, so let's just go. I didn't get cancellation, right? That's kind of kind of sad. Wasn't there cancellation there on the ground? Um. No. Okay. So let's just disrupt the invade then. Only five elves. Hmm. Kill the hero, please. Oh, wow, he survived. Back so the tigers don't kill you. Really? Yeah, you can do that, but it's not gonna save you. Break the door, force them to come out, kill this, please. All right. Poison them, wait. Okay, yeah, so that killed quite a few, but it's okay. 
vampires can just regenerate. Are you for real? Should only hit the sprites, there we go. Kill. Hit. Here we go. Oh, I killed the... Well. Okay, in terms of HP, yes. I still, yeah. <laughs> Out of shots, huh? And there we go. And that was that, so Mr. Green is dead. Captured water meat. And oh no, he's not dead yet, really? Although maybe that's because I, uh, because the game sometimes does that. You need to uh, save the game and reload, and then it registers the the fact that you have defeated the AI. I don't know why it just it does that, but sometimes it happens. Okay. Anyway, uh, so we captured this town. We got our bonus from the uh, Magic Spring or uh, Sacred Grove, actually. Uh, yeah, and as you can see, he can build everything, but he had no time. He didn't build. Wasn't even able to build his level three units, so because we were very fast. Got some items from him, and let's see what spells we got. We got Summon Leprechaun, okay, that's very good. We got Speed, uh, didn't get, unfortunately, uh, didn't get that, uh, what do you call that? Stone Skin? Well, that's okay, uh, Summon Leprechaun is good enough. Good enough for us, yeah. Those are basically all the level when spells from nature you want. And Stone Skin, hopefully we can get in the next scenario, so yeah. Alright, uh, this we don't need. We don't need to take this because we already have a lot of speed. Golduff is uh, faster than anybody in the game. Um, yeah, he has 8, but in battle he has 3 more, so in fact, actually he has 11. 11 speed, so... <laughs> Did he have Caravan and Hill? No, he doesn't. Okay. So now, uh, we need the uh, gre uh, Blue Border Gate to go through here. So, uh, that's underground, so, yeah. Let's go there. And take it. Wow, he didn't recruit his troops, why? Some way here. Um, do I need to fight those? I guess I do. Yeah, just run, I don't need to. Alright, so, what I'm gonna do for these unicorns, it's gonna be, it's gonna be four stacks of unicorns, right? Well, that's gonna be four. I'm gonna take the Thunderbirds. I don't need them. I'm just gonna fight with vampires and Cyclops. And ghosts, of course. There we go. Um. There we go. Easy battle. And the last one. There we go. Three. Uh, I guess I can hit three like this. Uh, I can summon some sprites just to keep one of these guys over there. Hit three again. Come on. Come on, I was able to do it before. Oh, maybe I, now I can because of the sprite. No, there we go. Nice. Okay. 
And there we go. Nice and easy. And we did it. Underground, I don't think we need to find more enemies. I'll just bear. Yeah, okay. There we go. This is... Yeah, I need screen player, green player eliminated, but I did that. Okay, so... Hold off campaign save. I just need to load. See? And now hit the next turn, and green's eliminated. I don't know why... <laughs> It always happens on this scenario for some reason. Uh, I did not register the fact that I killed him. But, yeah. There we go. Sword of the Gods, in case you want that. <laughs> uh, it's very good. But you need to fight dozens of, of those guys, which is not something I want to do right now. So, you can get a, you can get a level 3 death spell here, but, yeah. I don't need any of this. I'm just gonna recruit my troops. I need, uh, need some of that. No wait, I need four. Right? Yeah. Four of those. There we go. Cool. Now, create. Three days. Create two days. Um, some ghosts. And two. No, one vampire. Okay. Good enough. There's the blue thingy. That's basically all we need. This is a level two death spell, which I think is Meyer. Get out of here. Uh. Yeah, it's always Meyer. You can use that to slow the enemy, uh, not on the battlefield, but on the map. So that if you're chasing somebody, you know. It's actually not that bad. Although I never use it. <laughs> but yeah. Alright. Everything's here? Yes, everything's here. Okay. So we just now take the army and go for the AI, I guess. Not much else to say about this. So yeah, uh, let me just check this again. So one death spell, okay, three. Disrupting ray. This was ray skeleton. Oh, I did not get ray skeleton. Uh, should I go back for that? Eh, I don't think so. I'm not really going to be using ray skeleton all that much. I can use it maybe sometimes, but no, not in this case. And eventually I will get it from a from an undead town. So. Yeah, not, not a big deal. Maybe cancellation. Cancellation would have been nice. That could have helped in this one battle here for, versus this um, this dude. But if it does not give it to me, well, what are you going to do about that? Yeah, Vitros. There it is. The one town that we need to fight. And this is the main guy. No, it's not the main guy. The main guy is somewhere over there. Okay. There he is, or there she is. Yeah, has hundreds of those, dozens of those, and scores of those. Uh, level 8 mage. The hundreds of halflings on top of the tower are going to be nasty. But, uh, but other than that, it's, it's not going to be a big deal. Yeah, and unfortunately, I cannot do anything to stop them from shooting. They're just going to precision them, probably. That's what the AI does. <laughs> but yeah. So yeah, but we did get everything on the map. We got the stat boost from both of, this town, both of these towns. Got the stat boost from this one. Got the spells. Got the crystal here. So yeah. This is gold off. My gold off for next scenario. 32 attack. No, 27 attack, sorry. Uh, from basic melee. And uh, yeah. And 69 defense. Get some mana there, and uh, we are gonna get some level two death spells from this town as well, because it's an order town. Now, after we take it, and that's gonna be pretty much it. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Just flag it. Why not? <laughs> All right. Let's just kill.
kill these. Oh, really? Are you serious? Killed by my vampires. I hope it's enough from this hero to get it back. I think it is. There we go. And kill. Nice. Okay. So, that was level 4. Actually, were those the main guys? No, the main guys are here. Okay, so... Yeah. Uh, hundreds of halflings. That's going to be kind of nasty. But... I'm going to have to deal with it. There's no... No other way. I can put these guys here. See if he's going to shoot them. Well... We'll see. Get this. At least we have... Yeah... Alright. Save the game. Yeah, 394 of those. I can confusion them. Well, these guys can just... This guy can just dispel that, yeah. He's the vampires. No. What can I do in this case? I guess just curse. Yeah. Hmm. Those guys are gonna die anyway. Yeah, precision. I knew it. Oh, I didn't make it. Uh, golems are not something really nice when you're fighting, when you're using vampires. Closer. Keep doing that. <laughs> uh, I need to kill the hero. I'm just gonna keep casting nasty spells. Uh, HDs. Thank you. Yeah. There we go. Good. Okay. Uh, here we go. Good. Oh, I did not cast that this time. Oh well. Okay, there we go. Oh, I got bam around. No, that's why I did. What did I cast? Okay, so there we go. We did it. We did it. Bam. <laughs> nice. All right, thanks to that cloud of confusion. Thanks to that cloud of confusion, I was able to do it uh, quick and without losing too many guys. Of course, I lost my Thunderbirds, Thunderbirds and some of those guys, but it doesn't matter. We did it. Yeah. We did it and it was pretty easy. Uh, 
prison or naka. Yeah. And we captured Petros. And haha, he had that. Or she actually. And the uh, scroll of town gate. Hmm. Okay, so the small rising from the chair charts remains of Vitros threatened the obscure to obscure my vision to the stake in the center of town. I put it in the same place where the people had tried to burn me months ago. This time, however, the commander of Vitros uh, was tied to it. What's your name? I asked, raising my voice to be heard over the screams of the dying. I grabbed the officer's hair with my dead hand and yanked hard enough to make him yelp. Uh, what harm is there in telling me your name? I said. Sir Martyr of Vitros, said the officer. Queen Amelia will march the enemies uh, will march the enemies of Great Arkan against you for this attack. I will be avenged. I don't think so. Right now, one of your own commanders is on his way to Great Arkan to give his account of how a band of barbarians attacked Vitros. Of course, oh yeah, because I was using barbarian troops. There will be no survivors left to contradict the story. My zombies have already cleared the countryside of every farmer and woodsman. Sir Martyr shook his head in disbelief. Uh, it's true, Sir Martyr. It's amazing sometimes what a man will do when he's offered immortality. When this cooperative commander returns from the Arkan, one of my vampires will change him into one of the undead. So, you see, Queen Amelia will have no cause to suspect me for this horrible tragedy. Uh, what are you going to do with me? Martyr asked weakly. What do you think? <laughs> Martyr looked around. The only thing that wasn't on fire was the wood at his feet. My own living skin was... Uh, was tingling from terrible heat. It was taking all my will uh, power not to turn and flee this inferno. You're going to burn me. Yes, do you remember me, Sir Martyrash? Of course. Then I want you to know that I was innocent. I was not responsible for any deaths uh, save those of the chickens. Great Arkan, as young as nation it is, as young as a nation as it is, has earned respect for its fair laws. Tell me, where was that justice for me? Sir Martyr closed his eyes, praying. I slap him to bring his attention back to me. I'm going to burn you, Martyr, until there is nothing left but bones, I said. But that won't be the end of it. Afterward, I'm going to use those bones to trap your soul. I need a military commander I can trust. I nodded to one of my skeleton soldiers. The creature held a torch to the pile of wood at Sir Martyr's feet and stepped, uh, stepped back to the flames as the flames took fire. I'll be seeing you again soon, I said, turning my back as Martyr screams joined the rest. Wow. So yeah, <laughs> don't mess with Golduff, man, wow. And that was that, scenario number one, completed it. In the scope of the universe, we are but a single breath. To say we're insignificant is to give us too much credit. But when the universe chooses you to be a part of its plan, You'd better hold on and take what you can get, because your ride will surely be over before you know it. Uh, maybe, yes. <laughs> I don't know what to make of that. But anyway, uh, so this is the second scenario, and now we're limited to level 18. Okay, so um, the scenario is not very complicated. Uh, if you do things uh, quick enough and you kill the AI before it has time to build up an army, uh, you're fine. You don't need to worry about anything. So, uh, the scenario information is this: a stealthy vision from another realm enforced Golda that his master Caliber didn't uh, didn't perish during the reckoning. Now he must battle crusaders and demons, demons, sorry, to find a way to reach this uh, other world and rescue the one who saved his life long ago. So now we're rescuing rescuing Caliber, and that's basically what we need to do. That's the victory condition: rescue this guy's master Caliber, and uh, yeah, lose. Cool to have this with loose condition, medium sized map, and let's just begin. Seldom do I dream, but this was no nightmare. Uh, this was a vision that shocked me awake uh, with a searing pain. Fire, blistering, agonizing heat, agonizing heat. It took more time for me to realize uh, this wasn't my pain. Some memory of the flames that nearly killed me long ago by my master's pain. How? Caliber perished during the reckoning. He could not have uh, survived, could he? But if he still existed somewhere, uh, would, ha would that not explain my ever-present nagging feeling that something important had been left undone? My answer came as another image I, f I flashed into my mind like a club uh, to, the, to the back of the head. It was my master's face surrounded by the cruel, taunting images of demons. Master, I said softly. I could still see his pleading eyes. I received no answer, but I knew that. I knew what I had to do. I had to find him. I had no choice. 
So yeah, we're now uh, trying to find Kaliber. This is the second scenario. We start from here, but we're going to do that uh, next time. So thanks everyone for watching and see ya.